During a time of crisis, we turn to God. Our prayers to Him, Christ, the Virgin Mary, and the saints have offered help and miracles to many believers. Saint Nikiforos the leper is a new saint that has emerged the last decade, and many Christians are having sightings of him instructing them to not worry about the coronavirus, that he will protect them. He was born Nikolaos Zanaikis in a small village in Crete, Greece in 1890. When he was orphaned at 13, he moved to Hanya and learned the trade of being a barber. Two years later, he began seeing dark rings around his body, the first signs of leprosy now known as Hansen's disease. He knew that if anyone knew that he had leprosy, he would be sent forever to the leper colony on the island of Spinalonga, which no one ever left if they were sent there. Trying to escape his fate, he left for Alexandria, Egypt to work. His condition became worse, and he sought counsel from a priest who arranged for him to go to the island of Hios to a leper hospital there. In Hios, his disease continued to worsen as did the pain and disfigurement from it. Devoting his time to prayer, he strove to cleanse his soul. He smiled often and shared joy with all he met. In two years' time, he was tonsured a monk by Father Anthimos and had the most beautiful voice as a cantor of the Divine Liturgy. He eventually left for Athens to a hospital that was advanced in treating leprosy and had the antibiotics to treat it. The disease was too advanced to be cured, and St. Nikiforos suffered excruciating pain. He always was kind and patient, offering joy to anyone who met him. He thanked God for his suffering and believed that it enabled him to focus on his spiritual development and to God. It is not the trial, but how we respond to it that tells of who we are. He reposed in 1964 at the age of 74. His bones were fragrant after his death, and many people have attested to him interceding in miracles and healing in their lives. During the time of COVID, he has come to many to comfort and heal them from the virus. Leprosy, like COVID, isolates us from our loved ones to combat on our own. This struggle makes us more humble and human. He has come to the bedside of many struggling with COVID to heal them and in visions. He has been seen in dreams and visions in Greece and Bulgaria. <laughs> Και του είπε να, να πει στου Έλληνε να μην φοβούνται από τον κορονοϊό. Και αν νοσήσει κανένα, θα προσευχηθεί σε μένα και εγώ θα τον φροντίσω. Πώ θα βρει, Αποστευτικό, θαύμα είναι. This doctor speaks of his experience when he was in the hospital suffering with COVID. From, from a very good friend who said to me, Chris, I want you to pray to this saint. It's, his name is Saint Nikiforos the leper. Uh, and I'm sorry, I get goosebumps while, and again, it's a lot different if you would actually see me while I'm saying this, but um, it was St. Nikiforos who said to me, pray to St. Nikiforos the leper because he's appeared to many people who have coronavirus, and he has said, pray to me, and if you have coronavirus, and, and I will be with you. Well, lo and behold, he sends me a picture he sends me the, the paraclesi of St. Nikiforos, and I said to him, George, this papuli was in my room last night. Mm -hmm. And I, I just got extremely emotional, saying to myself, why me? You know, from multiple standpoints, why did he come and visit me? I don't know him, I've never prayed to him, um, but why did he choose me? He says to them, do not fear COVID. Pray incessantly, multiple times a day for his help. Ask for forgiveness and say the prayer, Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy on me, and he will be by your side, healing and protecting you. <laughs>